So what's at stake? 2020? Everything. Everything's on the line. We are fighting for public education. What's at stake in 2020? The future of our children. The future of education of our children. The future of the justice system. What's at stake in 2020? Everything's at stake in 2020. Affordable housing is critically important. We've got to ensure that children have safe places to live and they're not sleeping in cars and getting up trying to go to school. In 2020, we start redistricting. And if we don't have a seat at that table to fight against gerrymandering and for fair districts, then we're going to see another 10 years of Republican rule. Look out for the little guy, the little gal, the least, the last, the lost among us. That's what being a Democrat's all about, and that's why the stakes in 2020 are so high. We have to make sure that we work on Medicaid expansion so over, over almost a million people can have access to health care. In 2020, we're fighting for our lives. Everything's at stake, whether it's women's issues, the rights of immigrants, protecting our environment, public education, and sure we have a diversified economy where everyone wins. 2020 is where we make or break it. We have so much at stake in 2020. We have affordable housing, fairness and equality, gun safety to protect Floridians. If we don't win in 2020, our teachers are in trouble. If we don't win in 2020, our law enforcement, public safety is in trouble. Everything is at stake. What's at stake for 2020 is the education of our children, keeping public schools fully funded. Ir peleando todo eso y mejorando la educación Eh, para, para tener un futuro mejor para todos aquí en el Estado. What's at stake is the courts. We are seeing so many problems and we have to make sure that we protect our rights. We need to protect Roe v. Wade. We need to protect voting rights. The courts are truly an issue on a national level and we've got to make sure that we get people in who can appoint justices and judges who will support the issues that really matter to us. There is so much at stake in 2020. What's really important to my district is funding public education. That is one of the reasons I'm here. So what's at stake is we really need to even the odds. We need to turn the state blue. We've been saying that we need to get out there. We need to do it. We need to engage the voters. We need to get people voting Democrats so that we can do more. Everything is at stake in this next election. Our whole faith in our government and democracy is at risk. What's at stake this election is so important. We're talking about the future of public education. We're talking about access to health care. We're talking about affordable health care. We're talking about a woman's right to health care. We're talking about simple, fundamental things that we've all taken for granted, like voting. Public education is at risk. Affordability of college is at risk. Health care for every individual in the state and in this country is at risk. I think about the impacts of climate change on our cities, on our coasts, on all of Florida, and whether we will elect leaders that will take action, provide leadership in addressing those issues.